Good morning, dear students. Students, today we are going to talk about uh, monocot and the dicot leaf. In uh, previous lecture, we have learned about uh, dicotyledon and the monocotyledon's root and the stems. So leaves are the remaining there, right? So today we are learn about a leaf so first of all we are the talk about the general informations of the leaf right so leaves are the very very important part in a plant because they are the concerned with photosynthesis and the transpiration process and leaves have also three types of the tissue like the stems and the roots right they have uh, three types of the tissue systems the dermal tissue ground tissue and the vascular tissue right and the dermal tissue systems are the consist of uh, upper epidermis and the lower epidermis in a leaf uh, two epidermis are the present upper and the lower and the upper side and the lower side both side stomata are the present but uh, a majorly lower side frequently stomata are the more than compared to the upper side so the ground tissue system that lies between the epidermal layer of leaf is known as a mesophyll tissue in a leaf uh, mesophyll tissue are the present and their tissue are the lies below the epidermal layer epidermis je layer je any exact niche ni baju apanne mesophyll tissue mesophyll cells jova mare je and often they are the differentiate into the two different kinds of the cells palisade parenchyma and the spongy parenchyma and this palisade parenchyma on the adaxial side adaxials that means the upper side and the spongy parenchyma cells on the abaxial side abaxial that means the lower side so this palisade and the spongy parenchyma both are the types of the mesophyll tissue right and a leaf showing this is a differentiation in the mesophyll is a designate as a dorsi ventral and it is a common in the dicot leaves so we are the find about this dorsi ventral that means a dicot leaves dorsi ventral leaves hoy to ene aple dicot leaf kai sake karan ke ini je mesophyll cells ni je arrangement che ena aadhar ene dorsi ventral kevama aave ch मोनोकोट स्लीव से बीजा नाम ओखे कहवाई आईसो बायलेट्रल राइट बिकॉज इफ मेजोफील इज नॉट डिफरसिएटेड लाइक दीज इन द लीव दैट मीन्स हियर नो एनी स्पोन्जी एंड द पेलिसेट सेल्स आर द डिफरसिएटेड राइट सो इन मोनोकोट प्लांट हेविंग अ नॉट डिफरसिएट सेल्स ऑन डी द मेजोफील सेल्स सो दैट्स वाई दे आर कॉल्ड आईसो बायलेट्रल and the mesophyll tissue are specially spongy parenchyma cells and close a lot of the air space spongy parenchyma cells is a uh, loosely arranged right and the presence of the air space is a specially feature of the spongy cells and the facilitate the gaseous exchange between this internal photosynthetic tissue that means the mesophyll cells and the external atmosphere through the stoma mesophyll cells are having the chloroplast okay and the vascular tissue system is a composed of the vascular bundles right xylem and the phloem both are the present in the dicots and the monocot leaves and they are the collateral and the closed type of the vascular bundle vascular tissue forms the skeletons of the leaf and they are known as a vein 
and they when the supplies the water and the minerals to the photosynthetic tissue apanne khabar chhe ne ni andar veins hoy je veins je chhe e one type of the shoe je skeleton ubu kare je right ane e water ane je minerals je supply karva ma e helpful thai je and the morphologically and the anatomically features of the leaf help in its uh, vital physiologically activities vital physiologically functions right so let's start uh, we are the separately study about the dicotyledons leaf so uh, the internal structures of the dicotyledon leaves and uh, example is the sunflowers right and uh, in this image uh, we are the clearly observe and the very clearly seen the epidermis region that means the uh, upper epidermis region and the lower epidermis regions pellicet cells spongy cells and the uh, muscular systems they all layers are the very distinguished right very differentiated so let's start the one by one we are the learn so first of all the epidermis right so here both epidermis both type of the epidermis upper and the lower epidermis right so dicotyledons leaf is a generally dorsi ventral because here mesophyll cells are the differentiated in two types pellicet parenchyma and the spongy parenchyma so that's why the dicotyledons leaves are called dorsi ventral leaf right and it has upper and the lower epidermis and epidermis is usually made up of the single layer right and very compact arrangement right and uh, no any intercellular space is a uh, present and here upper, upper epidermis and the lower epidermis both are the made up of the parenchymatous cells and the uh, having the cuticles uh, layers right upar ni baju ek cuticles nu layer pan jova mare chhe stomata are the more in the number on the lower epidermis than on the upper epidermis in a general case uh, we have to uh, calculate the stomata but here directly write down the uh, lower epidermis having the more stomata compared to the upper epidermis right and a stomata is uh, surrounded by the pairs of the bean set cells is uh, called uh, guard cell we are the already study about uh, stomata structures right in uh, 11th and the 12th science right so what is a guard cell so bean shape like structure and they bean shape like the structures that means a guard cell and this guard cell through cover the stomata right so each stomata each stoma opens into the air chamber and this guard cells contain the chloroplast and various other epidermal cells do not contain the chloroplast chloroplast ana sivai koi pase hase nahi but this guard cells having the chloroplast and the main function of this epidermis is to give the protections to the inner tissue called a mesophyll right so now this mesophyll turn right and the mesophylls are the very lies below the epidermal layer and the cuticles helps to the check the transpiration process and stomata are the used for the transpirations and the gaseous excretions so now we are the discuss about the mesophyll cells and the mesophyll cells uh, tissue are the uh, between the upper and the lower epidermis is called a mesophyll right and uh, the mesophylls are the differentiated uh, two types right pellicet parenchyma and the spongy parenchyma pellicet parenchyma cells are the scenes banat the api, upper epidermis the pellicet parenchyma cells se kai jagah jo marse upper side right and it consists of the vertically elongated jahi tame niche joi sako jo aa je cell che kai je pellicet che keva je elongated che cylindrical cell je in one or the more layer and ani andar apanne be layer che jova mare je and these cells are the compactly arranged without intercellular space and uh, pellicet parenchyma cells are uh, contain the more chloroplast than the spongy parenchyma cells 
જેવી રીતના એપિડર્મલ સેલની અંદર એક ગાર્ડ સેલ પાસે ફોટોસિન્થેટિક માટે ક્લોરોપ્લાસ્ટ હોય છે એવી જ રીતના જે મેઝોફિલ સેલ હશે સો મેઝોફિલ સેલમાંથી પેલિસેડ પાસે સૌથી વધારે ક્લોરોપ્લાસ્ટ હશે કમ્પેર ટુ ધ સ્પોન્જી પેરન કાઇમાં રાઇટ બટ મેજરલી જે ક્લોરોપ્લાસ્ટ પ્રેઝન્ટ જે કેની પાસે છે પેલિસેડ પેરન કાઇમાં પાસે and the function of the pellicide parenchyma is a photosynthesis right now the spongy parenchyma so spongy parenchyma lies below the pellicide parenchyma right a pellicide ni exit niche ni baju chhe apda ahya joi sakiye chhe and they are the irregularly shaped ena koi regularly shaped nadi compared to the pellicide parenchyma pellicide parenchyma are the elongated cells right cylindrical elongated cell but the spongy parenchyma cells very irregular in the shape and these cells have a very loosely arranged so that's why here air space are the present and as a compared to the pellicid cells the spongy cells and the contain the larger number of the chloroplast right spongy parenchyma cells also having the chloroplast but uh, compared to the pellicid very lower chloroplast right number of uh, lower and the spongy cells are facilitated the gaseous exchange with the help of the air spaces loosely arrangement che etla mate emni andar space che ane gas exchange mate easily che the air space that is found next to the stomata is called a respiratory cavity or the substomatal cavity pucha ek marks ni andar ke respiratory cavity etle su athwa to substomatal cavity etle su so the air space that is found next to the stomata it's called a respiratory cavity and the last one is a vascular tissue and vascular tissue is a separate by the xylem and the phloem and vascular tissue are the present in the vein of the leaf and the vascular bundles are the conjoint type collateral type close type right any types of the vascular bundles xylem is a present towards the upper epidermis while the phloem is towards the lower epidermis yeah yeah clearly joi sake je blue color na je che e su je phloem je ane aa je che upar ni baju ahya tamne red pinkish type je color dekhaye e che tamara xylems and xylems are the divided into two types protoxylems and the meta xylems and the vascular bundles are the surrounded by compact layer of the parenchymata cells and it's called a bundle sheath cells and the xylems are consist of the meta xylems and the protoxylem vessels right already i have told you the xylems are the differentiate in two type protoxylems and the meta xylems and the protoxylem vessels are the present towards the upper epidermis right protoxylem che e upar ni baju hase ane meta xylem che e niche ni baju hase to meta xylem je che e phloem ni nazik hoy clear and the phloem consist of the sieve tube companion cells and the phloem parenchyma in this case phloem fibers are the absent and the xylem consists of the vessels and the xylem parenchyma here also xylem tracheids and the xylem fibers are the absent so now we are the moving on the monocotyledon leaf so also similar the dicotyledon leaf but some arrangement is a different right and image jo change thai gayi clear so this monocotyledon leaf uh, also having a three regions epidermal ground and the stilly region that means a vascular region right so first of all the epidermis region upper and the lower both epidermis are the present and they are made up of the single layer of the thin walled cell and this is a made up of the parenchymata cells and the outer walls are the covered with thick cuticles right and the number of the stomata is a more or the less or the equal on a both the epidermis so upper side and the lower side both side more or less or the equal any number of the stomata are the placed 
and the stomata are the surrounded by the dumb cell sap the guard cell so here guard cell sap is a dumbbell sap and the guard cells are contain the chloroplast and various other epidermis cells do not have them jevi ritna dicotyledon ma che evu j ritna che only guard cells having the chloroplast any other epidermal cells having a no chloroplast and the some special cells bound the guard cells and they are the distincts from the other epidermal cells called the subsidiary cells or the accessory cells je stomata nu je structure apne study karelu che right eni andar apanne khyal che ke subsidiary cells ane accessory cells pan adhe goi pan name tame ene odkhi sako jo subsidiary cells che e guard cell ni aaju baaju hoy che some cells of the upper epidermis are the larger and the thin walled and they called bully form cells or the motor cells oma jem bundle se thata right evi j ritna jem apne joy na vascular system ma bundle se cell che evi rite upar ni baju ama epidermis je che upper epidermis ane je che e baju tamne large ane thin walled je jova marta hoy eva cells jova mare to e cells ne kaya name odkhavama ave che bully form cells athva to motor cells and these cells are the help for the rolling and the unrolling of the leaf according the weather change weather pramane hi change thai ene rolling kare unrolling kare right some of the epidermal cells of the grass are the filled with silica and they are called the silica cells and atyare apne je structure joi rahiya chi already apne grass nu structure ad joi rahiya chi mesophyls the ground tissue that is a present between the upper and the lower epidermis of the leaf is called a mesophyll cells and the mesophyll is a not a differentiate into palisade cells and the spongy parenchyma right so that's why the cells is a called iso di uh, iso bilaterals right and the mesophyll cells are the very nearly isodimetric and the thin wall sap and uh, it is uh, for the many reasons the grass leaf is uh, described as a uh, iso bilaterals right and uh, these cells are the compactly arranged with limited intercellular space and uh, we have the discussion in a uh, dicotyledons leaf palisad and the spongy cells or spongy cells having the many intercellular space right but here no that type of the arrangement here very very limited levels in the intercellular space is a uh, present otherwise uh, they are the compact arranged and they contain the numerous chloroplast and the chloroplast are the helps in the photosynthesis right and the last one is a uh, vascular bundles and the vascular bundles are uh, differ in the size not uh, size is a mention and uh, most of the vascular bundles are the smaller in the size and the large bundle occurs at a regular interval so large is a say regular interval ni andar gothvayla as otherwise uh, many vascular bundles are the small in the size and the two patches of the sclerenchyma are the present above and the below the large vascular bundles right and these uh, sclerenchyma patches give the mechanical support to the leaf in the leaf uh, sclerenchyma patches are the present and the sclerenchyma cells are the dead cells so that's why the very um, uh, higher levels in the mechanical strength is uh, provided and the small vascular bundles do not have a such a sclerenchyma patches only the large vascular bundles are having the sclerenchyma cells and in this image you very clearly we can observe this red and the pink like the cells and this cells is a sclerenchyma cells and this is a large vascular bundles and this is a another both another two is a very small vascular bundles and they vascular bundles having a no sclerenchyma cells so in this image you very clearly we can observe right so vascular bundles are the any types uh, conjoint collaterals and the closed type and each vascular bundles is uh, surrounded by the parenchymatous bundle 
see and uh, in this image we have the observe the orange color in round one circles and this is a bundle sheet cell bundle sheet right and this bundle sheet through cover this vascular bundles this cells of the bundle sheet uh, generally contain the starch grains any in the starch grain j hoj and the xylem of the vascular bundles is uh, located towards the epidermis and the phloem towards the lower epidermis right so in this case also similar this uh, uh, xylem are the towards the upper epidermis right and the phloem are the towards the lower epidermis jo blue color che jo kai baju nazik thai lower side and upper side so these xylem are the very uh, towards the upper epidermis and the phloem are the towards the lower epidermis right so now we have the major difference study about a major difference between the monocots and the dicotyledons leaf so in this uh, slide we have the observe the both leaf transverse section of the monocots and the transverse sections of the dicots leaf so just think about which uh, types of the difference we are the seen in this image both image તમે જોઈ શકો છો ઇમેજની અંદર અને અત્યારે આપણે સ્ટડી કર્યું એટલે આપણને ખ્યાલ પણ છે કયા કયા ચેન્જીસ છે અને ઇમેજ ઉપરથી પણ આપણે કહી શકીએ કે આટલા ચેન્જીસ છે આ ચેન્જીસ છે બંનેના સેલ્સની અરેન્જમેન્ટ જોવો સેલનો સેપ જોવો વેરી ડિફરન્ટ રાઈટ સો નાવ જસ્ટ વન ટેબલ્સ યુ હેવ ધ રિમાઇન્ડ first one is a monocot sleeves and the another is a dicot sleeve right so generally monocot sleeve uh, having a upper and the lower epidermis same as a dicot sleeve right but upper uh, but uh, mesophyll cells are the not differentiated in monocot sleeves dicot sleeve having a differentiated right mesophyll are the differentiated uh, upper pellicide cells and the lower spongy cells upper surface is a dark green while the lower surface in a monocot sleeve but dicot sleeve having a equal uh, equally similar the surface greenish color right and the stomata jo dekho stomata na ghana bada type che apne khali ani andar evu kai didu che short ni andar ke lower epidermis hoy tya vadhare stomata hoy ne upper side vadhare hoy બરોબર છે આવું એક ખાલી એક નોર્મલ કેરેક્ટરિસ્ટિક્સ લખેલું છે પણ સ્ટોમાટાના આપણે ડિફરન્ટ ડિફરન્ટ ટાઈપ્સ હોય કેટલા મેં કીધું એમાં લેખ્યુની અંદર કે આપણે એને કેલ્ક્યુલેટ કરવાના હોય કે કઈ બાજુ આપણને વધારે સ્ટોમાટા જોવા મળે છે અને સ્ટોમાટા જેવી રીતના જોવા મળતા હોય એના આધારે એના અલગ અલગ ટાઈપ છે જેમ કે મોનોકોટ સ્લીફની અંદર એમ્ફિસ્ટોમેટિક જોવા મળે છે કે સ્ટોમાટા આ ધ ફાઉન્ડ ઓન ધ બોથ સાઈડ બંને બાજુ જોવા મળતા હોય અને ડાયકોડ ની અંદર છે વધારે પડતું કેવું છે હાઈપોસ્ટોમેટિક છે સ્ટોમેટા ધ ફાઉન્ડ ઓન ધ ઓનલી લોવર સાઈડ જો ખાલી લોવર સાઈડ જોવા મળે તો એનો હાઈપોસ્ટોમેટિક કહેવાય અને બંને બાજુ જોવા મળે તો એને એમ્ફિસ્ટોમેટિક કહેવાય અને આના સિવાયના ઘણા બધા ટાઈપ છે ટાઈપ છે એ આપણે માસ્ટર ડિગ્રીની અંદર ભણવામાં આવે છે અત્યારે ભણવામાં નથી આવતું એટલે હું અહીંયા વધારે ડિસ્કસ કરીશ નહીં પણ એક ટાઈપ છે જો આ યાદ રહી તો તમારા માટે વધારે સારું અને એના સિવાય આવ્યું હતું કે જે ગાર્ડ સેલ છે ગાર્ડ સેલ જે ડિફરન્ટ ડિફરન્ટ શેપના છે મોનોકોટની અંદર ડમ્બેલ શેપના છે રાઈટ અને જે ડાયકોટ જે છે ડાયકોટની અંદર કિડની શેપની અંદર હશે પછી જે મેઝોફિલ સેલ છે એ ડિફરન્સિએટ થશે નહીં મોનોકોટ્સની અંદર અને ડાયકોટની અંદર ડિફરન્સિએટ થાય છે અપર અને લોઅર એપિડર્મિસની અંદર હવે મોનોકોટ જે છે એની અંદર ઇન્ટ્રાસેલ્યુલર સ્પેસ ઓછી જોવા મળે છે આ જે મેઝોફિલ સેલ જે ગોઠવાયેલા હોય એમાં જ્યારે ડાયકોડની અંદર ઇન્ટ્રાસેલ્યુલર સ્પેસ છે આપણને વધારે જોવા મળે છે રાઇટ અને લીવ્સ વેન આર ધ પેરાલલી એરેન્જ ઇન અ મોનોકોટ્સ લીફ મોનોકોટ્સ લીફ એન્ડ ધ લીવ્સ વેન્સ આર ધ ઇરેગ્યુલરલી સ્કેટર્ડ ફોર્મ ઇન ધ એરેન્જ ઇન ધ ડાયકોટ્સ લીફ રાઇટ એન્ડ ઇન મોનોકોટ લીફ હેવિંગ અ લાર્જ વાસ્ક્યુલર બંડલ ઇન ધેમ અને જ્યારે ઇન ડાયકોટ લીવ્સ હેવિંગ અ બોથ ધ સ્મોલ એન્ડ ધ લાર્જ વાસ્ક્યુલર બંડલ ઇન ધેમ મોનોકોટની અંદર પણ લાર્જ વાસ્ક્યુલર અને સ્મોલ બંને જોવા મળે છે પણ ઇન્ટરવલ ફિક્સ હશે જ્યારે ડાયકોડની અંદર એ ટાઈપનો કોઈ ઇન્ટરવલ છે એ ટાઈપનો આપણને જોવા મળશે નહીં સો ધીસ ઇઝ અ મેજર ડિફરન્સ બિટવીન ડાયકોડ્સ એન્ડ ધ મોનોકોડ્સ લીવ્સ
तो अँ आप सिलबस कम्प्लीट थी जाए सिलबस हज एक यूनिट बाकी है आई नो बट यूनिट नंबर वन जो सिलबस प्लांट एनाटोमी ए कम्प्लीट थे नेक्स्ट लैक्चर अंदर हम एक यूनिट जो बाकी है यूनिट नंबर टू ये जोशू राइट स्टार्ट करसू